some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, uh, we find ourselves in Oregon with uh, the uh, fraudster known as Cult News, as he well is causing trouble on the streets of a local town and ends up giving a uh, average guy the sauce because you know how antagonistic this jackass can be. So he pepper sprays him just because well he antagonizes him. And uh, he comes back and stands up to uh, this frauditor, but unfortunately he ends up on the wrong end of that can of sauce. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this freaking S show on the road, shall we? Are you videoing the brand? Yes. Oh, can I ask why? You can ask, but I can't tell you. I, uh, I've got an employer and, and uh, I'm under pretty strict instructions not to chit chat with people while I'm out working, so. I what can't. Company are you with? I'm sorry. What company? Are you I, with? I can't tell you that either. If I tell you that, then you know who it was that was investigating you. So, okay. sorry. Damn, frauditors have no issues about lying to anybody, especially the average uh, citizen, not just cops, but the average person on the streets. Oh my goodness, you fra frauditors are definitely scumbags. Now, of course, the cops are called and. Uh, they do absolutely nothing to him because, you know, he's on a public sidewalk, blah, 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 you know, that kind of thing. But later that day, he ends up encountering somebody who's not going to put up with his BS. So let's roll that beautiful bean footage, shall we? All right. Now we're heading down the street. Let's see if any other folks here in town have a problem with the first amendment shall we how many times do we have to say this to nut jobs like you that uh it's not the first amendment that people have a problem with it's lame jackasses who act like a bunch of uh well childish morons who uh, uh they have a problem with uh, especially with the uh, well, shoving a camera in their in their face and uh acting like a complete insensitive Brick. But hey, I guess that's why a lot of you end up in jail and prison and everything like that, because you have no boundaries to begin with. Do I want to stop for a second? Sure, there you go. You dumbass frauditors always cry about somebody needing to de-escalate a situation, so you... Uh, escalate a situation by giving this guy the bird? Oh my goodness, you were actually looking for a confrontation at this point, weren't you? If this ended up going to trial or anything like that, this little statement right here could be used against you in the court, you dimwit. It would show intent. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I'm a little defensive today. How can I help you today? Well, you want to get defensive. Yes, sir. I do want to get defensive. You want to go take pictures of me, and then you flip me off yeah, when okay. I take I'm a picture of you. I'm done with you, little Come man. here. Nah, I'm good. Well, sir, didn't you know that frauditors hate handbacks? Yeah, because, you know, there's the old frauditor saying, rights for me, not for thee. So you, they can film you all day. But the moment that you pick up your camera and uh, give them a cam back, they want to whine, cry, and complain and everything like that. But you know what? They secretly hate the First Amendment, but they use it to cover up the fact that they want to uh, run a criminal enterprise that uh, nobody else will know about. I mean, am I right, dude? I mean, that's what Sean Paul Reyes does. Come on, you little worm. What can I do for you? Just smile. Again, there you go. <laughs> Fuck off, loser. Seriously. Yeah, I'm standing right here, Chief. What can I do for you? Am I, am I a piece of work? I already got you. I don't give a rat's ass. I got your license plate, 779 NUA, huh? Are you drunk, sir? Have you been drinking today? You been drinking today? You been drinking today? 
Well, of course I have. Wow, are you, are you drunk right now? You dipshit. I had a glass of water for breakfast. I had a Gatorade for lunch. God, yeah, what yeah, an yeah. idiot. Get out of here, loser. Seriously. You're just a little fucking worm. That's what you are. You're a little fucking worm. Little fucking yeah, worm. you're a little fucking you're worm. Touching me now, sir. You are touching me. Get away from me. Hey, can you call the police on this man? He just came up and pushed up against me. Call the police. I got it all on video, you little bitch. Why was he up there? Because I'm out here taking photos. Ma'am, can you call the police, please? You think you can walk up to somebody on the street and push into them and think there's no consequences? Huh? You want another shot? Come at me. Yeah? Oh, you want some more? Bring it on. Seriously. Can you call the police? Yeah. Just call the police and say I was just assaulted. <laughs> yep. I sure did. And I'll do it again if you keep coming at me. You want to keep coming at me? I wouldn't come this direction. You start walking toward my voice, you'll get it again. That's right. You walk up and assault me, you get sprayed. Yeah. Go cry to mommy now, bitch. You know, it takes a real coward to do something like that. I mean, this guy uh, antagonizes the whole situation. He uh, pepper sprays a guy that probably meant him no harm to begin with. He was just a cam back him originally. But he had to push those buttons, push those buttons until the guy walked up on him. And according to him later on, it was uh, cult news that uh, assaulted him by uh, walking into him. But amazingly, we don't have that alternate uh, viewpoint that he always has as far as the other camera angle that follows him around. I mean, amazingly, he shows uh, the bits and pieces of everything that he wants us to see, but never shows us that which will incriminate him. You were crying a minute ago, aren't you? Well, it looks like you're crying right now, aren't you? You think you can just walk up to people on the sidewalk and push into them and think there's no consequences? We have emergency. Think again, jump. I was asked by an old man to call the police. There's a couple of them out here fighting. One of them was approached negatively. Somebody was sprayed with maize, and it doesn't look like it's really de-escalating very quickly. Well, this video was over 40 minutes long, so I had to cut out so much of it to get to the point of the video. So let's go ahead and uh, skip to the point where the police interview the victim of uh, Colt News' uh, anger issues. 256, play for scratch pad. 779, Nora, Union, Adam. You said... Hey, officer, Hold I'm on. a big fan of apologies. If he wants to apologize to me, I won't press charges for him assaulting me. One second. No problem. Take your time. All right. So, did you first see him at the bank? Yeah, he okay. took a picture of me when I was doing my business at the bank. So, I stopped here and took a picture of him. And he immediately started baiting me, trying to bully me, trying to get me into doing something. And, and then you stopped out and uh, we're talking to him right here. Oh, I was talking to him over there. Okay. Because he kept walking. And I just was, hey, what do you think of picture? You know, I want a picture of you. So immediately he flipped me off and then started cussing at me. It's all on his video. Okay. Okay. I'm so sorry that you're a piece of shit and a worthless human being. I apologize. <laughs> Step up, sure. Step over here with me. Just step over here with me, please. I'm. I hear you. Just have them take a look at you. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm taking one step at a time here. Okay. Uh, you're free to go at this time. Um, you guys. Depression charges. Well, he said if you guys can handshake this out to no, try. To, no. No. Not, no. Uh, okay. The man. The man pepper sprayed me he baited me into walking up towards him 
He stepped into me and, and then immediately, he had that pepper he, he, spray ready. He saw this the video exactly, already, this Chief. This is exactly what he did. Okay. And he actually is stepping into me if you watch the video. Okay. All right. Well, thank That's you. the reason that he's got that. He saw the video already, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're free You're to lying. go. Um, yes, he saw that video. But what about the uh, other video that you have? The one that shows the uh, other perspective that the other person, the other camera person that you have around uh, video recording this all the damn time. What about that video footage? Did they see that one? Or uh, did you conveniently forget to tell them about that? So... I'm not going to pursue this any further. So, if there's uh, anything that I need to reach out to you for or anything like that, I'll give you a call. But uh, other than that, you need phone number? I thought I might have already grabbed that from you. I guess I didn't. I'm sorry about that. Okay. Awesome. Thank you, sir. And sorry about the circumstances. And please have a better rest of your day, mister. So. This world is full of pieces of human excrement that do things like this just for mm -hmm. Take care. Okay, okay. The cop really doesn't want to take this much further, but I'm going to leave you guys with this little uh, clip that shows his intention of using the uh, sauce no matter what the circumstances were. I'm not gonna lie, I've been kind of wanting to test this thing out for a little while. So now we know it works. I'm not happy with the stream that comes out, though it's not really a stream, it's more like a, a mist. So a little disappointing. If there was a strong wind blowing back at me, I'd have gotten it. So definitely got to get some new uh, pepper spray. Well, I got a question for you, dude. Uh, if you wanted to test that spray out, then why the hell did you use it on somebody to begin with? The easiest way you could test that spray is by going out into an open area where only you would be affected by it should the wind catch it. So, yeah, that shows intent that you were wanting to use it on somebody to begin with, you lame brain dumbass. So overall, your intentions were to assault somebody in a video and to make it look legit. That is just flat out dirty, dude. I mean, lowest of the low. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you uh, tried to enjoy the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. This could be some groundbreaking stuff right here. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's... Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?